Hey guys, so I'm going to be showing you how to get Arrow in a Windows Vista virtual machine. So, you need to be in your virtual machine, so as you can see I am. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is turn off the virtual machine. Don't even, don't even shut it down. Just go down here and just straight up turn it off. This is because we'll need, we'll need to boot into safe mode and next time we turn on the virtual machine it will give us the options to do that. So. Alright, also to get error you need to make sure you have a 1 gigahertz CPU or higher. So go to settings. So go to system. Make sure you give the virtual machine 1024 megabytes of base memory. So once you've done that, go to display. So go and check this box, enable 3D acceleration. and then go up here to the video memory box and type in 128 Okay. so once you've done that you can click OK and start the virtual machine so once it starts up it should give us the option to boot into safe mode or resume windows normally Okay, so we're at the screen now. So what you want to do is you want to go up here and click and click and sorry and hit enter on safe mode. So once you have the login screen, go ahead and log in. Okay, so we are now in safe mode. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go down here. This is for, works works for VirtualBox, so go to Devices optical drives. Well you can either insert the guest edition CD image, but what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to optical drives and put in the guest editions ISO or virtual box 6.1 and then go to start, go to computer, then click on this. Let's see. So go ahead and click on this. Alright. So we're now the setups to click next. Click next. Make sure to check direct 3D support. Then click install. It's gonna install all the drivers that we need. Install this driver software anyway. Call driver software anyway. All right. So once you've done that, you can click finish and restart. Okay, so go ahead and log in.
Okay. So now on the desktop. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna right click and click personalize. We go to display settings and turn up your resolution to whatever you want. Alright. So once you've done that, you can go to window color and appearance and click on Windows Arrow. Then click apply. Ah, sorry. Then click up. Then click up apply. And there we go. We have Windows Arrow. This is what it looks like. And yeah, that is how you get Arrow in a Windows Vista virtual machine. Hope you found this helpful, and see you in the next video. Goodbye.